download error when you're using downloader on a fire stick or fire tv possibly even nvidia shield android tv this is a common error that a lot of people seem to get i get this error throughout all of my comments saying um when i show an install how to install an app i get this error a lot and i'm going to show you how to fix it really easily an unknown error has occurred check your url and connection close then you can't download the app and people give up we're going to show you how to fix it we're going to talk about it before we do that though if you can do remember to hit the subscribe button check out the rest of the channel because if you had this error for downloader you're going to love my channel it's full of application installs it's full of fixes tips tricks for your fire stick fire tv how to watch movies boxing sport all that sort of content on one channel and if you're a regular watcher do hit that share button so first things first if you've ever experienced this error let me know in the comments so what happens is you get to a website, it doesn't have to be specifically my website, but you want to download an app. You click on that download button, boom, you're getting this error, okay? So downloader here is an application on your Fire Stick which is used to install apps from third parties, from unknown sources outside of the app store. But it has to be set up correctly to use it. So if you're receiving that error, not everybody does, um, it's an error if people don't set it up correctly or if you don't follow the correct steps. It's really simple to fix. So what we're going to do really quickly is go to your settings on your Fire Stick. If you're on a different device, you'll need to go and find your settings and then your application. So once in settings, go across to applications. Go down to manage installed applications. Then go all the way down to your downloader. Click it. And in here... Hit for stop and clear data. Okay, fine. You hit for stop, clear data. Now, when you launch it, this is the important part. Here, allow downloader to access photos, media, and files on your device. Many people hit deny. You have to hit allow. Okay, it needs to access your files and your folder to save what you are downloading. If you don't save what you are downloading, it won't work. Okay, so you click allow. And you click OK, and now when you download something, it will work. As long as the link you are downloading is compatible, it will work. So we go back to my website really quickly, which is 75726. Click go. The link for my website is linked underneath in the comments as well, so do check it out. You can go on your mobile phone if you want to have a look. We go to my website on Downloader, and we're going to demonstrate downloading an app now on a fully working downloader. So scroll down. So you'll see. Well, if we get an app, I'm just going to do a test app at the top here. doesn't really matter which app, just to demonstrate. If an ad pops up, hit close. Okay, so now when we hit the download button, like normal, or whichever website you're on, as you'll see, it'll start downloading. Nice and easy, nice and simple. Brilliant. I hope that one helped you out. It was a nice, simple guide. We kept it quick. Remember, if that did help you out, you're going to love what's on my channel. So do check it out and hit that subscribe button. Quickly before you leave, if you can, a quick word from one of our partners. NordVPN is linked underneath. This is a partner of ours. We get a small affiliation if you do sign up to NordVPN and keep your security and stay safe online. We mentioned at the end, so for anybody who is interested in a VPN or in supporting the channel, NordVPN linked directly underneath is the way to go, and that does help us out. Brilliant. I'm out of here. I said I'll keep it quick. I've been Dog Squiffy. I hope that quick tip helped you, and I'll see you after the weekend. Thank you very much.